The cost of cancer care has exploded, and this has faced patients with the extraordinary burden of not only having a diagnosis of cancer, but facing financial difficulty. It is very important that you talk to your physician about this, because financial toxicity impacts cancer care. Most places have financial navigators that can help you. For example, if you don't have insurance or if you're underinsured, make sure you speak to your financial person at the cancer centers that you go to to figure out what your actual responsibilities are. Also, that could help you choose the location of your care. For example, hospital-based therapies are certain hospitals that get to charge you facility fees just for going there. Whereas a private oncologist's office would then be a cheaper option. Just like you discuss what your cancer therapies are, it is very important to understand what the costs of your cancer care are. One, is that the best place for you to get your testing? For example, your scans. If it's a hospital base, it may be more expensive. Just have this conversation with the doctor to make sure that they can find the best options for you. It can be very debilitating if you build up huge cancer bills and do not have a strategy for it. There are a lot of foundations to help, insurance helps, but also there's a lot of local help that can potentially help you paying bills. But you need to ask to be able to access these help. And once you do that, you'll be able to get an understanding of what your real responsibilities are and what's reasonable and what's not reasonable. Don't hesitate to ask because nobody's going to come outright and give you this. You need to advocate for yourself, advocate for your family, and make sure that in addition to great cancer care, that they can help you financially as well.